The shootings, the suspect in the shootings will head back to court this week. Frazier Glenn Cross, also known as Glenn Miller, is being held on a $10 million bond. Miller faces capital murder and first-degree murder charges. He could also face federal hate crime charges. And today could be the last day in office for the rural Missouri mayor who said he supported Miller's actions. Now Dan Clevenger is the mayor of Marionville, Missouri, a town southwest of Springfield. Last week, he told the media he agreed with Miller's stance against Jews. Sayed Shabir is in our newsroom with how his community is responding. Sayed. Patrick, his comments erupted a storm of backlash from the citizens he represents and from his colleagues on the board of aldermen. Tonight, the board meets to discuss what happens next and what one option is removing Clevenger from office. Now, he was elected two weeks ago, and two days after the deadly shooting, he said Miller was right in some regards. He said, quote, I agree with him. We've got a false economy, and some of those corporations are run by Jews. A lot of citizens were outraged by the comments. Some even rallied this weekend. One member of the board of aldermen submitted her resignation, and the very next day, the city attorney did the same thing. However, supporters of the mayor say his comments were meant to be informative not threatening. Now tonight the board meets to discuss the issue and they will also take comments from the public. Now to impeach the mayor, the board needs four of the six members to vote yes, but right now there aren't six members. One seat used to be Clevenger's but was left vacant when he was elected to mayor and as I mentioned one board member has already asked to resign. Plus if the mayor is impeached he can ask for a hearing which could cost the city a lot in money as far as legal fees. So the next steps are unclear at this point. We should know more after tonight's meeting. In the newsroom, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.